Hello everybody, welcome to Two Minutes with PJ. Today's date, April 14, 2016. Our discussion is going to be about being secretly or in secret. In Job 4.12, this truth was given me in secret, as though whispered in my ear. Basically, Job's telling those that were around him and trying to comfort him that God was speaking to him. In a, in a quiet voice. Isaiah 45, 3, And I will give you treasures hidden in darkness, secret riches, and you will know that I am doing this. I, the Lord, the God of Israel, the one who calls you by your name. God's giving the, these people, the Israelites, and taking care of them as he did when they first got out of Egypt. He continued to take care of them. Ephesians 1, 9 through 10, God has told us his secret reason for sending Christ, a plan he decided on in mercy a long time ago. And this was his purpose, that when the time is right, he will gather us all together from wherever we are in heaven or on earth to be with him in Jesus Christ forever. And the secret lives there. Now we know we should never worship idols in secret and we should not try and do things in secret for God sees everything. God sometimes calls us in secret, by especially when we're in a quiet place. He if we pray to him, we talk with him in secret, he hears us. Jesus will judge the secret lives of everyone. If we try to hide, he knows that we can't hide anything from God. God told us the secret of why he was sending Jesus Christ uh, and his plan for mercy and grace. God told us that he loved us, and this is why he sent Jesus into the world, to become the final lamb-free blood sacrifice for the penalty of sin. God listens to you and your prayers when you go to Him in a secret place. I want you to think about this today. Have a blessed day.